Anyway, let's go and see what they're gonna do. <sighs> Miracle. Isengard, a player known for MILF Hunters on Twitch against WWW guy, and he's he's a player who plays four versus four always, and he's from Iran. Oh, hold on a second. Bag of hunters. Oh my God, why am I doing this? Very annoying. It, hey, it evolves. Salut, salut. La poussin, comment ça va, la poussin? Ah, uh, okay, this flag is good. Yeah, ma poussin. Okay, uh, it evolves. Now flags are good. Now the flags are good. Wait, 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 wait. This one. Anyway. Um. Um. Oh, hey, hey, uh. Okay, anyway. Uh, we go to the game. Oh, God, all right. Hey, Gus of Ball, how's it going? How's your day, my man? We have the player WWW. He's from Iran. He's a good player. Against the Milf Hunter from Germany. This guy, Milf Hunter... Hey, GT underscore 87, how's it going? Player from Iran. Yeah, it evolved. He's from Iran. Uh, uh, WWW. I know him for a very long time. He's a good player in the 4 versus 4. But sometimes he does... Uh, I think Choi loves him. He's starting with two early orc pets. Orcs, orc pets, when, when people start with two orc pets, this is very uh, spammy. Um, I, I, Isengard will be over spammed by uh, Orc and the Orokai. Let's count the price of the Orokai 300. Hey, Fanfu, mon ami, le bêtise, Fanfu. So glad that you are here, Fanfu. Uh, how are you doing? It's so good to have you here with us, Fanfu. I always stream this favorite game. Uh, I know you like 4 versus 4 Fanfu and 3 for all, but uh, do you play also for, for uh, 1 versus 1 Fanfu? Uh, I think I am the same level with WWW as WWW. Oh, this is really great. So this means you can do games versus players. Guys, I'm planning to do challenges between the players. I want to see who's stronger between my friends in the community. For example, you know Milf Hunter, he's a tough bastard, he's strong with Mordor, but today he's picking, uh, he's picking Isengard, Milf Hunter, this yellow player here, he's picking Isengard, and uh, he started with Urukai Warrior, you should not uh, skip these Urukai Warriors, uh, they deal lots of damage to the buildings and they are very very fast, uh, WWW is the Iran Iranian maybe, Persian, I don't know how to say Iranian. Uh, player um, he is um, he is uh, making this uh, Haradrim palace to get uh, horses Haradrim horses uh, but Mirac uh, Miraclex eat m what I think oh Miraclex is yeah stronger player oof he destroyed the Haradrim palace to prevent his opponent from making Haradrim horses uh Okay, Isengard is, is gonna defend himself with the crossbow against the Orc Warrior and this Orokai Battalion destroyed, let's say, two buildings. One Haradrim Palace and one uh, Furnace, this one. And yeah, crossbow are definitely gonna defend against the Orc. Uh, okay, Orc are very annoying, guys. They're gonna be everywhere. Milfanter is trying to... Uh, I mean, Miraculous is the same guy. Miraculous is trying to creep this warg uh, to earn some resources. Uh, Ghost of Bow, I think they call me them uh, Persian uh, people from Iran. Oh, all right, all right. No, no, no. Persian, it's an old name for people from Iran, I think. Like uh, nowadays, it's Iran. No, no more Persian, I think. It was an old name. 
Um, Man Hunter switched to the work pack and he wants to make work riders. You know, work are not so great against spam, although they can beat one org battalion. But if there is a big spam of orgs, this work uh, pack, they are all gonna die. Uh, Milf Hunter is gonna keep creeping with the Orokai pikemen. Um, and the and WWW is just gonna creep. Um, yeah, I mean, Miraculous, I would like to see more uh, of his games. Guys, the more you do one versus one, the more you improve. And uh, you're gonna have another taste for the game when you play one versus one. One versus one, I played many games, uh, many many games, many RTS games, and no game has one versus one uh, like this one. The builder got killed, uh, Miraculous killed him with the Warg uh, pack. Look at the Haradrims are stronger than the Warg pack. Shit, Haradrims are stronger than Warg pack, guys. I mean, yeah, definitely, Haradrims cost 450 resources. While the work pack costs 250. So 100. I also noticed in this game that the more expensive is the unit, the better it is. I mean, that's obvious. No, no, yes, hello, hello. Um, I'm doing great. I'm happy. I just ate uh, uh, some good stuff and I feel happy. I ate chicken alive. Uh, work riders are just like the Gondor Knights. They, uh, yeah, they trample. They have a good trample. But the problem for these war riders is that, is that they die very fast to the arrows. No matter what arrows, they they die versus all kind of arrows. Okay, but two battalions of them, and if you buff them, Milf Hunter is gonna probably buff his army. Oof, look at this army of orc versus the army of Orokai with war riders. Um, both of them are gathering their armies. Actually, WWW is retreating. He's bringing more reinforcements, more horses. Oh, oh shit! The war riders uh, died. Some of them. Um, for once, he ate a chicken. No, I always eat it, but just uh, today I, I just enjoyed it a lot. Um, they are gathering their armies in the middle of the map. Isengard has 600 command points. He's spamming furnaces. While the Mordor player has also 600, he has the Eye of Sauron. Um, yeah, I mean, Orc, uh, I mean, Pikemen or uh, Easterlings cannot protect all the Orc warrior and Orc archers. So, uh, he needs more Pikemen. One battalion can't protect everyone. Uh, that uh, army, that army of Orokai guys. Oof, Haradrim Lancers, alright. Two battalions of Haradrim Lancers can destroy Furnace faster. But Milf Hunter is sending the pikemen to defend himself. That's a big war chant uh, on the crossbow. And uh, look at this. He's sniping the pikemen off uh, the, uh, for the Isengard player. Uh, you, if there is no pikemen here, Aradrim Lancers uh, are coming to trample the crossbow. This is the plan of the Persian player. I mean, a player from Iran, uh, WWW, and it's a good plan. And he trampled some of the crossbow. He, Melf Hunter was putting the war riders on top of the uh, crossbow uh, to protect them. Uh, but still, they died. The crossbow died. Oof, Haradrim Lancers are following the war riders on killing, killing them. They got a higher level. Okay, that was the win for the for the Mordor player. WWW. Um, okay, it doesn't look good for the Isengard player. You know, Axorors are really great versus Mordor because they are stronger than Orc Archer. So let's see if they're gonna do it. Uh, they're gonna do something. Mordor late game uh, is very powerful, guys. Uh, very, very powerful with Black Orc and Haradrim uh, Archers. Uh, Isengard don't have. Uh, Elite archers. Isengard focuses on the melee fighters like Deathbringers and Berserkers. By the way, Berserkers are very bad versus Mordor. Mordor, uh, you just don't make the Berserkers, although they deal area damage, but they're just bad. If you play one versus one, you're gonna understand why they oh, why they are bad against Mordor. Oh, that a tainted land from Mordor against 
Miraculous. Miraculous uh, needs 10 power point to cover this tainted land. Uh, so it's a problem for him. And he has so many orc archers. Damn it, these orc archers, when they are buffed with the tainted land, uh, that is a problem. Archers in this game, they shoot very, 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 very fast. Hello, Yoda. How is it going? It was sarcastic. Oh, okay. Hey, Tim Martin. Guys, two people joined stream. They were Yoda and Yoda and Yoda and. Uh... Whoa, that's trample. Yoda and Mr. Smoke joined the moderator uh, team. He lost many pikemen, many horses. This music is too loud, right? I can't even hear my own voice. Yoda was this you who did this. Oof, that's a big, big army of orc archers killing everything. <sighs> killing everything. Balista maybe? Balista is gonna shoot. Balista, look at the orc archers shooting at the Balista. Okay, well, is it you, Yoda, who did this donation? Is it real? Fanfo has just donated thirty dollars. So much love for this. Oh shit, Fanfo! Hey May, good luck and thanks for being part of the BFME community. Oh, Fanfo, my friend, thank you so much. Yeah, I mean, this is my favorite game of all time. I mean, I I was here. I was born in this game. Thank you so much for the 30 damage. That's a lot. Whoa. Uh, guys, this game between Milf Hunter and... Uh, hold on a second. Uh, damn it. Fanfu, thank you, thank you, thank you, my friend. I mean, I know that you play lots of 4 versus 4, but I didn't know that you're interested in the stream also of the challenging games. I'm not doing such a thing every day. Okay, Yoda. Uh, anyway, let's focus on the game. Guys, this player, Milf Hunter, now he got his Lurts. Uh, Lurts is great to snipe Haradrim Lancers. Uh, and he gets, he level up so much when he shoots uh, fat units like horses. Uh, but wait, uh, they might kill him. Uh, he might also cripple the mouth of Sauron. I don't know how he got him level 4. Uh, we did not pay attention. Anyway, um, small camp of the work sentry in this place uh, from Milf Hunter, but it's gonna be destroyed. Uh, work riders, they can beat Haradrim Lancers, guys. Yeah, they are a stronger uh, cav. And Lurtz, if he cripples Mouth of Sauron, I still don't know if Lurtz can kill Mouth of Sauron with the Carnage. Because Mouth of Sauron counts as a horse hero, while Lurtz counts as a swordman hero. And normally in this game, swordman heroes uh, are weaker than Horus heroes. So, uh, yeah, do you see the damage? If Mouth of Sauron was off his horse, he would have uh, died earlier. Uh, that's the power of Lurts, Cripple, and uh, Murder. Uh, so many Orc archers, but they're dying to the War Riders. And look at this big axe thrower the army from Melf Hunter. Damn it. Uh, look at the Milf Hunter guys. Axe Thrower is a spam. Uh, okay, against Axe Throwers, Mordor should get Black Riders, guys. They should get Black Riders. Orc Archers, I mean, they're good. They're not bad, but at the beginning of the game, only. Uh, at the end of the game, or middle of the game, you should not get these Orc Archers. You should get Haradrim Archers. Um, and yeah, he's getting Haradrim Archers. Uh, they are from Iran. Is getting Haradrim archers. Uh, and yeah, but the axe throwers still kill. These axe throwers are made against archers. They can counter rangers, mirkwood archers. They are really, really, really great. And uh, Mordor should get um, um, black riders. Uh, they can trample the axe throwers. And uh, so far, he's not getting them. He's getting Haradrim uh, archers. And orc archers, he loves the archers, looks like. 
the WWW player loves the archers. Uh, oof, he got a fell beast. Miraculex got 400 po uh, command point. He's not rich with command point. These two players are um, destroying each other. Uh, Milk Hunter is gonna creep the troll and take his money. 13 power points. Um, um, look at this guy. He, ha he got 13 power points. And he can go only uh, for the fuel of fire. After the wildman summon. He can get the fuel of fire. If he got devastation, he could have gone either for... Oh, never mind. He got the devastation also. Uh, Milf Hunter. Look at Isengard, guys. It's a very rich country. They they can have instantly 2,000 resources. And uh, also, this faction is rich. Mordor. Uh, this farm... Okay, it's gonna defend itself. This farm from WWW against this battalion of pikemen. Yeah, even if there was no pi uh, archers here, it could defend itself. Guys, this battalion of Haradrim always makes me... Uh, uh, when I look at this picture profile of this Haradrim archers, I think this is the mouse of the battalion and these are the eyes. And I then think it's like an animal. But then I realized that these are like Haradrim, they are a desert people, this is his real face, it's a small area from this place. Uh, uh, l l hello, uh, number one and and uh, Al, uh, welcome. Okay, uh, this fell beast might, oh shit, this player is spamming fell beast, uh, www. I don't think fell beast is a great idea against the Axors, but let's see. Uh, Mordor is focusing on their heroes and Haradrim archers. He has industry, he can make money from it. Uh, and he can go for the Wyrm after the uh, industry. Um, Mordor, guys, Mordor, Mordor is focusing on the monsters. What can, uh, what can the Isengard do? They only have Har uh, Har axe throwers, wildman axe, axe throwers. While this Mordor uh, faction is getting Haradim archers. Uh, yeah, and two Felbis. Two Felbis are gonna destroy all the economy. Uh, and even axe throwers, if uh, the axe throwers are alone, for example, this battalion, it can be killed by, um, by the uh, Felbis. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Um, oh shit, this uh, Felbis. He needs to rest, to heal up. Okay, okay. Haradrim Lancers combined with Orc Archers. Uh, the player from Iran is splitting his army. Oh, we shed three, but four battalions of Orc Archers. They are just protecting this area. Uh, Milf Hunter, um, he's just... Uh, he's trying to harass with... Actually, yeah, Felbis can defend uh, against these Axors. He can murder them. And then fight the pikemen. Uh, if the axe throwers want to be deadly, they need lurks around them. And all the Urukai. So he can give them leadership. So, uh, Felbis then cannot uh, do any damage. Uh, okay, now he's getting the black riders or maybe catapults. WWW. He is getting the black riders. And this is what he needs against against uh, Isengard. And now he got the Wyrm uh, from his spellbook. Oh uh, shit, look at the Wyrm area damage guys. You see that? Destroying two buildings at the same time. Hello, Fernand. Uh, uh, okay. Oh shit. Um, yeah, Wyrm is, uh, yeah, yeah, Wyrm destroys buildings, that's what it is made for, uh, destroying the buildings. There is a small area from, a uh, small army and with lords. Oh, they got maybe axe throwers or maybe armor. Actually, they got, oh shit, they got the, uh, their upgrade, guys. They got their upgrades, did you see that? Damn it! The upgraded axe throwers, guys, the upgraded axe throwers with forge blades. That's a huge army. What did the Wyrm do? Destroy two barracks. Uh, this army is gonna be destroyed, but the Felbis died. And this tainted land was... Uh, okay, there is the Witch King. Witch King is 
not good against Axolos with Forge Blade. Whoa, shit. Look at the battalion of... Uh... Wait, did he cripple the Witch King? He did, maybe. Lurz crippled the Witch King. Uh, shot him, but it did not uh, kill him. Look at this player, guys. He loves to spam archers. Like, uh, his whole command point is made of archers. Uh, WWW. Uh, he needs pikemen. He really, really, really needs some pikemen. Uh, in case the, uh, his opponent makes the war riders. Um, okay, he still has the Witch King. I don't know if he lost the other uh, har small harassment from the war riders. Look at the Forge Blades damage, guys. You see the Forge Blades on the war riders? Once they get this, uh, they destroy buildings 10 times faster. The war riders are made to destroy buildings, they're not made to trample. Uh, they're not uh, made to trample no 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 they don't play now this is the game was made uh recently and it is decent so we're gonna see how each player is gonna play guys look at this level five access rowers uh level five it's gonna be better than two battalions of access rowers um okay one of the players is getting access rowers and the other player is getting big army of orc archers and Haradrim archers. Uh, and this some Mordor player is going to make the Black Rider. Definitely. And then the Isengard player is going to be in trouble. What can the Isengard do, guys? Mm -hmm. What can they do? Uh, what can the Isengard player do? He doesn't have Mumakel. He doesn't have Felbees. All, only he has Axeros. And they are strong, true. But, uh, but they... Uh, but they can't beat the Black Riders. The Black Riders are going to destroy the Axors. By the way, guys, Axors are good not against uh, uh, soldiers. They are even good against the horses. They can kill the Wolf Riders uh, and the Rangers, the Athelian Rangers, if they are in short distance. And they can even kill the Witch King. Oh, the Witch King might die. The player forgot. Whoa. He forgot his Witch King. Damn it, the... WWW forgot his uh, Witch King and the Axorus killed him. Killed him. Axorus, they have Forge Blades, that's why. It can't, it can't, yeah, you see this red axe around them. This is uh, this means they have their Forge Blades. He needs the Black Riders versus uh, a high, I mean, versus strong archers, strong axe throwers. I don't know if we count the axe throwers as archers. And look at this. Building their farms near each other. Miraculous, Milfanter, and WWW. Um, Alright, uh, this army of Haradrim... Uh, it's gonna destroy the axe throwers army. Definitely. Big, big, big army of archers. Archers are stronger normally than... Uh, they shoot faster. They shoot faster than axe throwers. But if the Axors have full upgrade armor and uh, blades, uh, then yeah, um, they they are really d deadly. Uh, no com okay, Black Riders are out from the player WWW. Uh, if he just can shoot with his arrows, the pikemen, uh, Black Riders can clean. Oh shit, look at this battalion. These battalions of War Riders upgraded with Forge Blade. And maybe armor too. He purchased the armor for them from the armory. And two battalions of war riders killed everything. All the archers, the army. Uh, no pikemen. There was no pikemen uh, for the Mordor player. Only orc and orc archers. Black riders are running for their lives. Very, very smart move from Milf Hunter or the player Miraculous. And Lurz is near the army. Guys, leadership is very important in this game. Uh, I like Lurz, honestly. He has all um, uh, abilities that make him a perfect hero. He's an archer hero, swordman hero, uh, blade master hero, just like Aragorn. I mean, Carnage is called. And uh, he has the leadership. It's the, it's the only leadership for uh, Mordor, by the way. I mean, for Isengard, uh, I Lurz leadership is the only one and he can even make money but Isengard doesn't need money they have lots of money they don't rely on lords to make them money right um hold on a second
Where did they go? Um, all right. Um, hold on a second. Yeah, now it's good. So well, yeah, let's check the command point for each player. I think our player um, has uh, painted the land ready, and he has 17 power point. He can pick anything he wants: watcher, or maybe uh, um, rain, or maybe the third one, which is uh, fuel of fire. Uh, so far, he did not pick anything. And the Mordor player is probably gonna save for the 25 power point of Black Riders got hurt. Black Riders can heal up at level 2. Uh, level 1 cannot heal. They cannot heal. And they get also the Dread Visage which makes the army around them weaker. Um, okay, okay, okay. Warg Riders army versus... Can you believe it guys that these Warg Riders can kill the Black Riders at this point? They can really kill them, just look at that. If they just catch them, war riders are dead. Black riders are gonna die to the war riders because they have so much damage. They have so much damage, the war riders. They they are weak against archers, but their damage is very high. Uh, I think the Mordor player WWW uh, uh, he he went for the fell beast guys. He went for the fell beast and he did could not control them well. What he needed is uh, maybe Mumakel. Mumakel can trample the war riders, kill the actors, and even kill the pikemen. If it doesn't uh, trample the pikemen, Mumakel is just deadly versus Isengard. Only guys, only archers, rangers, men of Dale, Mirkwood archers can kill the Mumakel with the, with a the fast way. And and Isengard don't have anything but axes and the crossbow. And these two stuff uh, don't have long range, so they're gonna die to the Mumakel. I mean, it will have an advantage against them. He got his fell beast back. It's uh, it is Kamul. Uh, okay, the screech is very very important. Uh, scaring everyone away. Got crippled by uh, alerts. Lost some HP. Tainted land from uh, uh, from the Ang uh, from the Mordor uh, player. Now it can be countered by the Isengard player. Wait, there is the alert. He kills all the Black Riders. Ooh, that was very well done, well played by the player. Uh, he cancelled the Tainted Land from his spellbook. Okay, he just look at his power point. He's not even picking the power point. The Isengard player. Uh, I know that this player WWW doesn't play one versus one, but he should have done better units. I mean, he kept spamming orc and uh, guys, the orc archers are not to be spammed. Come on, he should not have spammed the orc archers. He should maybe uh, is this game that no no it is a game that was made there recently. Uh, okay. It's uh, gonna be over guys and then we will do live games. Why are you so hasty like that? Uh, it's uh, gonna be over and also I'm waiting for uh, players for players um, Already on game ranger so we can oh there is a the player PBR Probably we will play against them once we finish this replay uh, It's a good uh, game guys. It is a good game. He got now the black riders back after losing them Black Riders, guys, you should level them up. If you don't level them up, level 5 of this player kept losing his uh, Fell Beast. Fell Beast are bad against Axe Throwers. He should not make Fell Beast when he sees Axe Throwers. Axe Throwers are fully upgraded with uh, Forge Blades and Armor and Banner. Haradrim's Mordor at this point need maybe a big Haradrim archers and Easterlings to protect them from the war riders. Orc warriors are no longer needed. Uh, this uh, PBR, yes, no, his Mor Mordor player is Miraculix. Uh, I mean, uh, Isengard player is Miraculix. Uh, while the play Mordor player is uh, WWW, they are from Iran. Um, he's, he's a player plays 4 versus 4. He doesn't talk a lot. And look at the trample of the Black Riders. Couldn't kill the uh, 
uh, accessories because they have their armor, Isengard armor. Um, I, I, I feel like Isengard needs Haradrim archers. Guys, you can't kill the Isengard without uh, arrows. Without archers, you just cannot. Isengard needs arrows. Also dwarves. Dwarves and Isengard, they need arrows. They are very, very powerful. And he's using the Wyrm to destroy the Uruk pit. Level 3. Okay, that's good. He lo that he lost his Uruk pit. Uh, and maybe comes happy. How uh, come Isengard still have no Saruman? Uh, Gus of Bow, he did not get Saruman. Uh, Isengard player because he kept buying armor and... Uh, Blades for the accessories uh, and uh, pikemen, and look at the war riders preventing Isinga, uh, preventing Mordor from getting uh, resources. Looks so damn good this game. That's the bringers even he got, and now arm. Okay, the dragon and www is destroyed. He is just.